Yo who too, what's going on? It's your Uncle Liam back with another video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how I get 4K quality on all of my videos using the PS5 itself. Pretty pretty straightforward to be honest. Not it's no secret, you know what I'm saying? But a lot of you guys be commenting on my montage of videos it's like Liam, how do you get 4K quality, bro? It's it's such good quality. How do you get it? My PS5 doesn't let me get it, blah 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 blah. Pretty much I don't even know. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you guys straight up. I'm gonna I'm gonna go show you guys all of my settings I got. So for example, like capture video clip format. I keep this on most efficient. Uh, these vary. Like sometimes I put it on in case I want to record audio, or whatever. But I'm gonna show you guys pretty much my video clip formats and everything I have, my settings, so you guys can like copy it down. Maybe it'll give you 4K quality. But um, screen video. That's all I got on. I don't have any other like HDMI ports to make it better quality. I have like an Asus monitor. It's only 60 FPS, 60 uh, 60 hertz. So yeah. So that's that. But I guess you can see the main things on Share Factory. So go on your Share Factory when you're making your videos. You project whatever. Do whatever you want to do. Add a clips in. I'm going to add a couple, whatever. I got recent ones here. Cod. Whatever. All right. So you edit this, whatever, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to obviously edit it because there's no point because it's going to take too long. All right. So you're playing, whatever. Edit the video. When you're about to upload your video, press options right here. Press options. Go to your export settings and put it on your highest quality. This is why I have it on all the time before I upload and render my videos to YouTube. Usually, I believe when you get on right away, it's going to be on the most efficient. So make sure you turn it on to this, the highest quality. Um, it will take a lot of space when you do actually download the video. So every time you guys, whatever, share a video clip, whatever, it'll render, right? You're getting ready to prepare for YouTube, whatever. When that's fully rendered... It's going to be actually on your share factory as in one clip. So this whole thing is going to be one clip. So you're not going to see these little splits, whatever. It's going to be one whole clip. Like it's like a separate video itself. So that's actually going to take up space on your PS5 itself. So you have to make sure you delete it. Because when, when, you, when you upload on the highest quality and stuff, it's like a lot, a lot, a lot of space, bro. But pretty much that's a trick on how I get my 4K quality. Again, explore settings. Go most or highest quality. 3840 by 2160. So that's pretty much 2160 by 60 FPS on YouTube itself. So if you guys are one of my montages, click the quality, you'll see the highest one is 2160 by 60 FPS. That's the trick, how I get it. Um, but yeah, when you go out, when you guys actually do go ahead and render this out, you post it on YouTube, it's gonna be 60 or uh, 4K quality pretty much. So yeah, if you guys have any other questions, please let me know down below. It's pretty straightforward, not really, not really any secret to it, to be honest. But um yeah, man, that's it. That's all I had to show, uh, show you guys. If you want to go ahead and leave a like on the, on the video, I'm about to say stream. What the? <laughs> if you want to leave a like on the video, subscribe, hit that bell. It mean a lot. 7K, we're just coming up on it right now. And I'm going to catch you on the next one. Peace.